Today we're going to talk about core strength and how it relates to lower back pain. Hey everybody, Dr. Brittany here with Bloomington Wellness Center. Today we're going to talk about core strength and how it can relate to lower back pain. Um, a really common misconception that people tend to have is that having a six pack means that you have a strong core or vice versa, to have a strong core that you need to have a six pack. That's not the case at all. Um, a lot of core muscles stem from your deep abdominal muscles, but besides that you also have core muscles that are in your lower back, all the way into your upper back. There's muscles in your glutes and surrounding your pelvis that are included in your core musculature, and also muscles wrapping around into the front of your hips. So essentially, any muscles that attach to the spine or to your pelvis are essentially included in the term core musculature. When these muscles are strong and they're balanced, what they do is they support your spine and they support the pelvis. In other words, protecting your lower back from any wear and tear that we put on it on a daily basis and protecting it from injury. What tends to happen for a lot of us when we sit in desk jobs all day or when we lead sedentary lifestyles is that these muscles can become very weak. When these muscles are weak, they lead to things like poor posture, poor body mechanics when you do things throughout your day like lifting or moving or exercising and things like that that can then lead to injuries in your lower back or just some pain over time when your muscles are working a little bit too hard. Especially if you're somebody who sits at a desk all day and knows that you don't fare your core very often. If you're somebody who has a history of some recurrent lower back pain or lower back injuries, um, or if you're somebody who has some kind of chronic poor posture as the majority of us do, there's a very good chance that you probably have some issues with a weak core. Um, especially if you're somebody who's had issues with lower back injuries or lower back pain in your past, it's really, really important to get yourself evaluated and get your body checked out before beginning any type of core strengthening program just to make sure that you're doing the right set of exercises and stretches for your body and to make sure that you don't then worsen any injuries or start doing a program that's wrong for you. Um, for the very large majority of us, a core strengthening program is very beneficial as far as helping rehab some lower back pain um, or just prevent pain in the back in general. Um, if you have any questions about this or any topics that you'd like us to cover, please feel free to leave a comment below. And if you like this video, you'd lo we'd love it if you would share with your friends and also subscribe to our channel.